Hi there, it's Tanya from Tatty Treasures. Um, it's Monday and it's the 3 in 15 Don't Fret Before Christmas Challenge. So this week it is all about fabric and I think you can probably guess we're doing uh, some fabric snippets. I think that's what they're called. Um, it's not on a roll, so it's not snippet roll, so it's Snippets, <laughs> snippet, <coughs> uh, snippet, strip. Okay, <laughs> so what I've done is I've ripped three pieces of, I think they call this calico, um, and I've done them in different sizes. That's probably about a centimetre and a half, that's probably two centimetres, that's probably about three or four. Because um, I thought then you can use them on uh, different things because I don't know what I'm going to use them on yet. So I've gone through my uh, laces and things and anything, you know, that kind of size I have just cut up into random squares and rectangles and things. I've got this lovely um, beading thing that was about that long so... Um, looks like I'm going to lose some of them but oh well um, I've cut that up I've got a couple of things that I've cut out of I think they're like some kind of neck curtain anything, but they're quite thick then I've got some of that netting stuff which I'll probably lay lay down first and then I've got some other laces but I haven't bothered cutting up because I want to see how I got on with the smaller pieces first that's just a blouse that I tea stained and cut up um, I think that's just some rab uh, rabbit <laughs> I forget the word random some random laces that I've tea dyed and then that's a, a peachy coloured one um, and I think that one is from a lace pack that I bought off Etsy. Um, that will be in one of my haul videos. So yeah, I thought I'm not cutting into them. I'll see, see how I go with these. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to be sewing them or not. So I have decided to stick them down with Fabri-Tac because <clears throat> the only glue stick I've got at the minute is this Scotch one. Um, and I'm not sure that it would stick fabric down even, you know, just for the purpose of the video. So I'm, I'm just going to do it with fabric so I can just try not to use loads. Um, sorry, all my glues have fell down. Um, so I can, you know, sew them if, if I want. So I think... I'm going to start off with probably putting these sorts of ones down, the more plainer ones, and then put the, the prettier ones on top. So, let's, let's see how we get on. What I'm thinking is, if I do a kind of line in the middle-ish, just part way, and then... I can start and oh, just dip my finger in, just started and my finger's glued up already. <laughs> oh dear me. Um yeah, just get a couple a couple down, um, like so, and hopefully that'll be enough to to keep them stuck down. Um I'll do the same with this one. I thought we'd do like one layer like this. And then we might do another layer, the same kind of thing, but just fill in a little bit more. Um, and then put some prettier ones on, on top. I've not done one of these before. I've obviously done them with paper, um, but I've not done one with fabric. Uh, I did have a go at the fabric <coughs> clusters, which will be in an upcoming video in the Woodland Wonders series. So you will get to, to see that if, if you're watching those videos. Um, I'm guessing any access you cut off or just leave. Who knows? Who knows? So that's covered quite a lot. So we'll just go down this one. 
oh, I've not used Fabri-Tac for a while and you remember how much it smells. Right, let's go back to the top one. So I'm guessing you're going to use more lace than what you think. Same as when you're doing it with the paper. Um, you seem to use a lot more than you think you're going to. Which is good when you're using scraps. Not so good um, when you're not. But these was all, you know, just little bits and bobs. Well, wouldn't have really been much use for anything. Tanya, turn that glue the other way around before you start. Dripping it on everything. All right. So that can go there. I think I probably will cut this one down a little bit because obviously I did want them different sizes and I did fancy having one a little bit slimmer. Um, and just to use on <clears throat> more smaller things or narrower things. What's that? A bit more on that. And just fibres are absolutely everywhere. It's funny, I've just sat and cut these bits up and then I went downstairs to make a cup of coffee and I noticed the mirror at the top of the stairs has got like this fine dust on it. And I thought it wasn't there before, and I'm guessing it's come from the um fibres of, of cutting the fabric because um, my clothes sorry are absolutely covered in fibres too so I'll put that one down there like so so that's pretty much that one covered right let's get this one covered thought it would be easier doing three which it probably is I just feel like I've not got uh, a lot of room looks like I'm gonna run out of the more plainer stuff let me just cut that one in half because it is a little bit too big and that's that get some more here I've got more of the netting stuff, but um, <clears throat> I had just cut a piece and and got it out. I didn't, I didn't get all of it out. I did think I would have enough of the more boring stuff. That can go there. Yeah, I might have to wipe my hands in a second, and that can go there. You know what? I should have used my um my knitting needle what I call my pokey tool let's move that out of the way so that's that that's that so I think I will probably end up um sewing these just to to catch it all because you know the there's bits sticking up everywhere yep let me get my pokey tool out I can't see it and I've not got my glasses on and I can't find them <clears throat> and I can't see to find them <laughs> so I might not find them I think they're actually <clears throat> in my work bag I might have said that I have lost one pair of um, glasses and they was like my current um, eye prescription so I'm wearing glasses that um, you know are a bit a bit less than what I should have on but at the minute I haven't got any on so <laughs> can't see see anything right so we obviously won't be doing another um, foundation you know the same because <laughs> I've run out so I'm gonna do them one by <laughs> one now, uh, just so I can reach a little bit better. I feel like I'm um, overstretching. Right, let's move these all a little bit closer. 
that's it. So we've still got some of this to, to fill in. So let's, let's use this up. Go like that. And we'll go like that. Yep. Oh, we won't. Let's get me get my pokey stick. That's it. It's okay until the stick actually sticks and you can't um, can't then get it up. Right, let's start. I don't know if some of these pieces are possibly a bit too big. I didn't really know what size to cut them, so probably half is, is a little bit better. So we'll have that. That where else wants filling in? Let me go there. Like so. Yep. I can't remember Dean Siobhan getting in such a sticky mess. And so they made they made it look super easy. <laughs> right, let me try gluing it on the piece. That might be a little bit better. A lot of these what I'm using are those ones what have got that little bit of elastic in them. So I did think that was possibly a good a good way to use use those bits up. I know when I've bought mixed packs of of laces and stuff they do have the odd ones of of those in so that's a good way of getting them used up stick that there right what else oh <laughs> they all stuck to each other well the, all the threads are uh, threaded around each other so we'll put that there, like so. I think that's the wrong way around. Let's turn that back on. Yep. <laughs> right, let's add some nicer lace in so we'll have that there now i don't know if another time i might get some of the edith holden um things what i've actually fussy cut and put them along it which i would probably do as i was using it so just to tie it in a little bit more with the Edith Holden theme. Oh my goodness. That's stuck to my arm and come off like that. Um, <clears throat> I've got a pretty one there. So I think I'll have that coming out there. Then to me, it looks pretty covered. So I'm not sure what I do from, from here. Um, perhaps I add a little bit of this kind of thing. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah, you need a little bit of sparkling, don't you? So if we're kind of thinking we was using it <coughs> in sections, I would probably be best to stick some down there. Stick some down here. I'm just thinking if I was, you know, using it as, say, the top of a pocket or something like that. So then we've got two pieces there. And then I might have one of those in the middle because that could actually be cut in half um, when you wanted to cut it down. So... That could go like so. Um, 
I feel like I need something else pretty, but I've not really, not really got any then. But that adds a little bit of interest. Let's just cut, cut that down a little bit. Yeah, these was off some uh, Mecca and somebody at, <coughs> at work gave them my, well, she gave me a piece, a piece of it. So that can go there and that can go there. Probably should have just cut those little bits off, like so. Yep. Now I have got some and I didn't think about it, so I haven't got them. Just got my little box out. Now I have actually got some more of, of those, but I've got some smaller ones too. So this glue is in a right mess. So we'll stick one there. It's like a burlap. And is it still stuck to me? No. I've got another one here. Like so. <laughs> Can you see this hanging from my from my uh, hand? So that's that, and then I feel like it possibly needs another one there and maybe there. So I've also got these sticky ones. I think Ali sent me those. Um, yeah, she sent me two there. So I might use those on on another. Got a little paper flower here. Might use that. So yeah, it doesn't look like I'm going to be sticking Edith Holden on it. So that's there. Me. I don't know if I can cut that off. Yeah. Let's see if that will stick down. So that's there. I think that's that was upside down. Um, yeah, I think we just want something there. I don't know if it needs a little bit more. Let me just cut a little bit of this off. Just needs a little bit of uh, different different colour on there. So that can go there. And then got another little paper flower there. So that can go there. So that's one. I'm not doing very well for three and fifteen, but we've we've done one. And it was my first I've ever done, so that's that. Don't know if really it could do with something in the middle, but I would probably, that looks really nice, but then if I do cut it, I'm not going to be able to cut through that. So, yeah, they look really nice. Um, they could be added as you're actually decorating. So, for now, that's that one. So I'll put that over there to, to stick. I think that's the word that I was looking for. So that's the thin one. Let's do the, the medium one next. Oh, or is this the... No, this is actually the, the bigger one. So this is probably going to take a lot of filling. Um, I think I might do this one with the pinks, but we'll get some... Other well, ones stuck on first. So we'll have that there. Um, they all like coffee colours. That one's pink. Let's use that white up there. That's a nice frilly piece. I can go there. Why do I keep sticking them 
outside, uh, back to front. And say so sometimes it's hard to to figure out what sides what, and obviously when you're just plonking them down, it's even even difficult. So that can go there. See about that can go there. Um. I've got another little piece of that, so that can go there. Okay, um, still got a little piece of that, so I might put that there, like so. Right, let's get some pink on there. Again, that's possibly a little bit too big. So that can go there. Sorry, I must stop saying that. <laughs> I've said it about 300 times in this video. And that can go there. <laughs> I think we all get it now. <laughs> oh dear. Right. So let's break all that pinkness up. So I think these are adhesive, so that one can go on there. Oh, here she goes again. Um, pop that there. Um, shall we get some of this lovely? Oh yeah. It's surprising, you know, one minute you look at it and you think, oh my goodness, it just looks like a load of cut, cut up pieces of material. And then it um, it slowly starts coming coming together. Yeah. <clears throat> Probably won't be well. Won't be able to sew all of this. I'll have to be quite careful uh, going round things. But I've actually got black thread in the machine at the moment, so. <clears throat> I'll probably leave sewing them until I'm actually doing some Edith Alden folios. So that's there. And then I will save that for the other one because that's the only piece I've got. Um, let's have a look if I've got any more little flowers. You can't really see that in there at all. I've got some little pink ones. Yep, yep. Okay. Let me see if I, because I was going to stick one there, but let me see if I've got another couple of pinky ones that's a little bit purplish yeah I've got a couple more pink ones I'm gonna say I don't have a lot of flowers and and lace things because it's it's not very often I use them and if I'm gonna be doing a project with them then I'll I'll just buy buy enough for, for what I need so that's that just stick that one down. Ish. <laughs> and this one can go there. 
So again, like I've got some um, pearl trim. You know, maybe if it was on top of a pocket, you could have that on the top. And then I've got some, some more of these. They're possibly too big for that kind of thing. I've got some little diamante ones. I do actually think there's probably a lot on there. So that's that one. So we've got a mainly pink and beigey one and then pink and white. So now I've got the slimmer one. Um, I think I'm going to do this more beige. Um, I've just got two pieces of calico left over. So I'll just... Oh my goodness. I'm going to have to get a wipe and just wipe the top of that, that glue. can't ignore it any longer. <laughs> it's horrendous. I'm going to put this one straight on so we can see where the, the middle is. Let's put some glue there. That can go there. Just snip that funny piece off. Right, let's have, shall we have some of these? I think it needs a bit more uh, browns going through. Let's cut some of this up. Obviously my scissors are all stuck up. Let's use, let's use those. So that's that. Yep. That's that. Um, yeah, just about cut it, cut enough really. Don't want to use that. That's white. As I say, when I wanted a white piece, I couldn't couldn't find any. And I think I'll have some of that there just to brighten that um, teeth. Well, I don't know if that's coffee stained actually. So I did that a while ago, and I did used to always coffee stain, but. Um, since finding the red bush tea, I much prefer um, doing it with a red bush. I do like the, the tone of that. So I possibly don't want that there. Do I want any more of that? No, I don't think so. Right. Shall we have some little pieces in? Let's just try and cut some of that off. So that could go like <laughs> so. Uh, right, that's there.
that's too much with with that on so I'm going to take that off and use that like, like that okay Glad to get this lid on, it's um, actually starting to give me a bit of a headache with not having no glasses on as well and then the smell of the glue. Whew. Right, stick that there, like that, got some on there, like, like that, yep. Yeah. It's not as thin as it first started out, is it? <laughs> um, I don't know if to have some other little burlap flowers. No, that, that really doesn't go. Oh, there's some. They're not too bad. Oh, have we got any more of those? I think I'll go with that. Um, I mean, again, you could, like, that's one of those, like, uh, button things you could put, put those sort of things on, or just some normal buttons. But yeah, with this one, I might end up putting some, some jewels on after. So, let's get that glued down and that'll be that so yeah out of i'm glad i didn't cut any more i could have cut about the right amount up so <clears throat> i'll put those in there excuse me <coughs> in a jam jar and save for maybe some some clusters and that's that so I don't think I can tidy that up enough <laughs> with my sticky, sticky fingers. I'm give my hands a good wash. Yeah, that thin ones is um, about as thick as the medium. And then that one. So there we have it. So thank you very much for joining me. See you soon. Bye for now.